How to make a layered custom art brush in Adobe Illustrator. Hey guys, Kerry Hawkins here with another VectorMade.com tutorial. Today I want to talk about how do you create this sort of layered, um, maybe you call it 3D brush stroke effect. So let's jump in. Somebody on uh, one of my Facebook groups was asking me, how do I create this look and I said oh you need to just use a brush stroke create a custom brush stroke so um, here's how I would do this you're gonna pretend let's just start with this red one you're gonna pretend that that you got a cross section of this that it's running you know horizontally and so you're gonna create a small section of it running horizontally so just click and make a small sliver of a line segment like that with your pen tool and then with that selected, grab the eyedropper tool and select the outermost color. Hit Shift X to switch it over into stroke instead of fill. And then go to your stroke settings and bump it up to, I'm going to say 12. Um, so that's your outermost layer. Hit Control C to copy that. Control F to paste it in the front. Hit I to grab the eyedropper tool again and select this middle red. Shift X to make it the stroke instead of the fill. Bump that up to, let's say, 8. Do the same thing. Copy, paste to front, I for eyedropper tool, and Shift X to switch it over into stroke, and then bump that up to maybe 3. And there you have it. There's a nice little cross section. Um, and then what you can do is just grab this whole thing that you've just created, bring it in here, say art brush hit ok make sure that the direction is going with um, you know left to right you want to go that direction and then hit ok and then uh, just come in here with your pen tool and go ahead and create a path um, that is similar to the one that you're trying to mimic here right so we'll just kind of do something like that boom and then if i click on the art brush i just made as you can see it fills that in Cool thing is now like I can create whatever path I want and it will um, add that to it if I click on it. So just real simple like that, right? Really cool, very easy. And then if you need to make any changes to this, you know, I would just keep this handy and come over here and, and maybe colorize this um, to the blue colors instead. You know, you can just go in here and edit these pieces and then come in and make another brush um, whenever you need. So. Uh, that's a really simple, quick, easy tutorial just to show you how to do some stuff there and, you know, get creative with it. You can do a whole lot more with these brushes, but for today, we're just going to talk about that. So leave a comment down below. Ask me any questions. I like to get to those as soon as I can and like, subscribe and share guys. I'll see you in the next video.